All right, so I'm going to do this really quick. Uh, I tried to make a video, but it kind of was long-winded. So here is the fitting that comes out of the injection pump. You need this side, this O-ring boss. Um, I don't know the size. I think it's 3 8 Take that off of your injection pump. Take that up to a hydraulic shop, a good one. Uh, the one, the first place I took it to was they didn't want to sell me anything for some reason. Um, but Midwest Supply ended up giving them to me because I brought them some donuts on Saturday. Uh, you know, just do what you got to do. Uh, but they're cheap. I think a handful of fittings was ten bucks, as opposed to going to Home Depot where, you know, you buy one in a package. You know, one of these was about five bucks. So, you know, I, I got a whole handful. I got all of this stuff, you know, a bunch of these things for $10, $15. So, um, make sure you find a good reputable supplier if you want cheap, uh, good, good, reliable, and inexpensive parts. Um, 3 8 O-ring boss, I believe. I'm going to stress this. This is a half inch by 20. If you go online and you Google search, you'll find many, many, many people saying that is the one you need it doesn't fit I promise you can see here there is a huge difference in size all right so here we are at the engine and that's where it feeds into the injection pump just that you know there's a brass piece that doesn't that's actually, I don't think it's brass that's actually part of that um, I don't know what you call that uh, part of the fil the injection pump and then that where it's shiny the new nut looking thing that's my new o-ring boss and it's on a some sort of a swivel compression fitting i didn't really like it but that's what he had so we ran with it that goes to a 90 and then to a 3 8 with the uh, uh the lagris fittings that are super easy you literally just push down and they come out um Everything's ran with this 3 8 um, SAE brake line, airline. Um, it's fairly inexpensive. You get 100 feet of it for 50 bucks, 60 bucks. And it's uh, dual walled, and in between is fiber reinforced. So it's very, very resilient stuff. It's not, you know, it's just floating around right now. I'll have it all tied up. Oops, later. Um, after I get everything situated. But anyway, that's that. Uh, if you need anything, just give me a holler. If you want to see, we use these quarter inch. It's a barb to a quarter F MPT. It says IP. But anyway, um, all that does is tie onto the 